Good evening, everyone. Today has been a very long day for us here in the School of Social Work, Jackson State University. But I wanted to make sure that you were able to log in to all of the accounts that you'll need to transact business here at Jackson State University. So I wanted to make a short video this evening just to kind of walk you through those steps. So I'm going to share my screen with you and I'm going to go to our home page and share it with you. One second here. Okay, so you'll go to www.jsums.edu. And the first thing you want to do is to look at what we call the net ID or changing your net ID. So you go into PAWS, P A W S, here at the top. You click there. You move to the enter secure area here. You should have received your J number today. For example, my J number is J00818378. And then you log in with your PIN. Follow the directions here at the top of the screen. screen. If this is your first time entering pause, your J number you'll need, and then your, your birth date is usually what you can use to set your PIN. So you'll put in your birth date and then it'll ask you to reset your PIN using a very, uh, a passcode that you actually come up with. So putting in my information, you log in, and you'll see all sorts of tabs. There should be a student tab, there'll be a information tab. You may wanna to go to the personal information tab just to make sure your name is correct, your phone number is correct, and things of that nature. But then you may wanna to go to the student tab in this area just to look in to see your schedule. But one of the first things you wanna do is if you go over to return to menu here on the right side, you'll see return to menu, and you'll see something that says activate net ID, change net ID password. You'll click here where it says activate net ID password, and you'll enter a password that you come up with twice, and then that will change your net ID. You need to write that number down that you have changed or the password that you changed it to because that will serve as your entree to many other areas of the website, including Canvas, for all of you that are taking hybrid and online classes. So after you finish resetting your net ID, you could actually go out of this, and you could actually go uh, back to exit here and return to the home page. And when you go to the home page, you can actually click on Canvas. Again, you'll use your J number, J00818378. And then you'll use your password. Let's see if mine works here. Okay, that didn't work. Let's see if this will work. Okay. Okay, so you can use that, that net ID password. And what you'll find is Canvas. This is where you'll come for all of your course information. 
you'll click on dashboard. Dashboard is where you'll find all of your courses for this fall. Some of you that just registered today, it may not show up until tomorrow because the dashboard has to populate in terms of the courses. Also, you could click on courses and also see what courses that you may have for fall 2019. So you go right in here and find uh, what courses you have. You'll go into those courses, say for instance, you were in administration and social welfare. Click into there. You should be able to go to the syllabus tab and see the syllabus for the course. Or you can open up the course, open up the syllabus and actually see all of the things that the class requires. Okay. And you should be able to do that for all of your classes. Uh, the, some of the professors are still working on some of the documents in their Canvas shells, but everything should be ready to go for everybody by Monday. So you may want to wait just a second to get all of your books, just to make sure you know what you need for the class, um, and just to be sure that we have the books. I know everybody's anxious about getting started but we will get started next week on Monday when you go into your classes and perhaps this weekend, some of the instructors. There's also a tutorial on Canvas that's located somewhere. Uh, I think before you get in, let's go to that page and see if I can show you uh, the other page of how you can log into Canvas. So you go to www.jsums.edu You can exit out of that. Hold on one second. Okay, let's get our screen back again if we can. Uh oh. Okay, you go back here. There's also a, a, a link for Canvas here. You could click there. There's a lot of information here. There's a help number here, an email if you get stuck or have problems. But there's also something for students here where you could actually register to do the online orientation. Okay, so this will help you in terms of navigating campus. I really highly recommend that you do this first before you do anything else. Uh, let's go back to pause for a second, and I'm going to let you go after this. Just wanted to make a short video. J0018378. And you put in your pen. When you see your student tab in this area, You'll also be able to ask, access your schedule, your bill, things of that nature. And you want to make sure you go ahead and make sure you accept your financial aid and validate your classes. Because if not, you may be purged. So if you have any struggles, just let us know here in the School of Social Work. Let me know. Send me an email. And uh, we'll try to work that out. I think for the most part, this is all. You could just kind of play in it see what the different bells and whistles are and things that you may need. Um, if you do, like I said, if you have any questions, feel free to uh, talk with me. I hope each and every one has a restful and safe weekend. And um, I think that's all I need to cover in terms of pause and canvas. So hopefully you can watch this video and follow along on your computer to access some of the areas that you'll need. Thank you, have a good evening.